Well, thanks for staking with us here at 530. The food and beverage industry has been hit particularly hard during the coronavirus pandemic, but some business owners are actually pushing ahead, even launching new ventures. Dennis Ting takes us inside one new coffee shop that opened right in the middle of the pandemic. While the coronavirus pandemic has hurt many businesses, even closing some permanently, some entrepreneurs are pushing forward, knowing that things won't be business as usual. I played college football at Iowa State for a year, and so it's something that, like sports to me, it's just natural. And, I, you know, I love coffee. A sports-themed coffee shop was the perfect marriage of two of Rob Arnold's passions. Over the last few years, Rob has worked on bringing his vision to life. But one thing he didn't plan for was a pandemic. I got my first round of financing the week before quarantine happened. So it was one of those things where it's just like, all right, this is what we're going to do. More than 30 restaurants closed their doors for good in the first half of 2020, with many citing the challenges created by the coronavirus pandemic. But the pandemic hasn't stopped other entrepreneurs like Rob from launching new businesses. More than 40 spots are already open, including Rob's shop, Pregame Coffee and more are slated for the second half of the year. I really think that opening a business during a pandemic, you know, don't be too scared to do it. You know, it's you weather, weather the storm, as we used to say in the Navy, weather the storm. Rob says the early feedback to pregame coffee, which opened Friday, have been positive. He says many have said mixing the coffee shop atmosphere with the sports bar entertainment is a welcome addition to the Nulu community. Just yesterday, I had uh, some medical and dental students come down and do some studying because they didn't want to go to a sports bar. They wanted to watch the U.S. Open, but they also wanted some coffee. As for the future, Rob says he hopes to eventually take pregame coffee to other cities around the country. In Louisville, Dennis Tang, WHAS 11 News. And if you want to support local businesses but need some help finding them, just text Love Local, one word, to 502-582-7290, and we'll send you a list right to your phone.